Let's go kill a boss. They don't want nothing from us. We will kill them all. They suck a fat di di dick. Oh, you will die. I've got you right in my eye. I will kill you, Sprite. I will defeat you. So are these warriors sacrificing themselves? Is that what's happening? What's that, babe? They... <laughs> Uh-oh, Shaggy. They are. I'm a sacrifice. All right, let's get some haste on our characters first. That's way better than last time. We got hit with that particle beam last time. That killed us since the hit. A Gino. I probably, actually, I will cast another haste. Let's do it on both our warriors. Or both our monks? No, they're not monks. I forget what they are. Black belts. Boom. That's what it is. Is that all you do is hit with particle beams? Is that literally the only attack you have? Is particle beam? That's what it's looking like. Might as well. Just go full auto with the strat. Have three attack, have her full or have Gino fully heal. Is there anything I need to worry about? Strategy on this says that we need to be worried about reviving people, but that does not seem to be the case. Did we just beat it? Oh. We gangsta. Gangst! Gangsta! Damn, four and a half hour stream. And like an hour and a half to two hours of that was grinding. For fun. Damn. Good graphics for Nintendo. In the beginning, there was a void. Then came light and darkness from them. Everything was born. The heavens, the skies, water, fire, life. Time inexorably brings all life back to its beginnings. Why are they using $75 words for a $2 game? That's not cool. But from the life, something was new was born. A shining force that separated the light from the darkness and illuminated the world. It was called hope. When the balance between light and dark is broken, the world again slides into oblivion. The chosen will appear once more. 
Do not forget the source of the warrior's power is the hope that lives inside us all. The feels, man. The feels. Dreams, despair, love. Time can obscure it all. Do not accept this. Do not forget it. And time will never ease what life has to offer. A race. I said ease. Jesus. Find your last remaining spark of light. A light that shines brightly when all else is dark. The light of hope. Man, I definitely would have been lost on this as a kid. Probably would have eventually found my way. Not half bad. Time to go home. There's no doubt in our mind that you're the true hero of this story. Yeah! Are we gonna watch the ship jump? Oh, we're not. It's been a pleasure. Pleasure's all ours, but I think it's about time I return. So we're dropping everybody off, it looks like. Thanks for your help. Fellas, you're back safe and sound, of course. Barely broke a sweat. Without your help, we never would have made it. Thank you. Uh -huh. If you ever need help, we heroes will be here. Come and train with us anytime until we meet again. Okay. Time to return, everybody. Prince, I mean king. Wait, why are we on the itty bitty baby ship? Why aren't we on the big ship anymore? Why aren't we on the events? Oh, I'm so confused. Why would we do this? Why would we go to the baby gap ship? I don't get it. I don't get it. Apparently, we're trying to say there's a love story between Douche and Selena, I think her name was. Weird. He, he threw himself into a furnace and somehow didn't die. seeing our buys. I kind of like this. I didn't expect this as a breakdown. Uh, Princess Sarah is saying that she wants to stay with us. Or the one lead? I don't know. I'm kind of confused. I don't know if she means us as the group or as like the lead as a hookup. Nope, the lead is a hookup. Save the world, you're amazing. I guess they weren't joking about you guys being the warriors of light. Heroes get a kiss from me, pucker up. Not so fast. Oops. World is now safe from darkness. All is pure of hearts. Thank you, warriors of light. Why is there an earthquake? Or why did the light disappear? Oh, 
the crystals back to its former brilliance. How does that work, though? Each of the four crystals are inside, like, a mountain, a fucking ravine, uh, a waterfall, and an underground basement. How does that work? That's funny. All right. I want to thank everyone for being here, whether that be five seconds, five minutes, or five hours. Your support is greatly appreciated and needed. Whether you're here, for, whether you're here just to watch, hang out, just to chat, whatever you want to do, appreciate it. Please follow me on my socials, Twitch, Twitter, Discord, YouTube, Instagram, TikTok. All that stuff is linked below. I'm going to let the credits roll. I'm going to get up, stretch my legs. We are going to end the stream when the credits are done, but I feel it's necessary, especially if I'm going to post this to youtube which i do uh i let all the credits roll so i can give them their credit because they do deserve their credit for making this game so uh that's been our final fantasy 3 series i do not plan on maxing anything out i do not plan on going back this is it <laughs> i think we are done uh i had fun with it it wasn't bad it wasn't great it doesn't help that it feels like you could just plow through it but that, i think that was our problem with one and two as well um we still have four, five, six, seven rebirth, which is coming out at the end of the month. Thirteen, I'm sorry, twelve, thirteen, and fifteen that will be playing on stream. So we've already been seven, seven remake, Crisis Core, eight, nine. We just beat nine, actually. That will be airing on YouTube shortly. Still need. 10 we've done one and two and now three so uh man i've had a lot of fun with this this is different it's a little bit different of a style of game compared to the other ones but i, I enjoy it uh thank you again uh i'm gonna throw the mic on mute while we finish up these credits and uh, we'll catch you guys on the flip side have a wonderful night
Hey, if you're still here, you're amazing. I appreciate that. You're not as amazing as my girlfriend, but you're still amazing. Actually, as we exit out and I'm waiting for the credits to finish to give the publishers, creators, programmers, developers, lead program, like anyone that had sound directors, anybody that had any kind of fucking hand in this, they deserve their credit. So that's why I believe in at least giving them their credits at the end. I don't skip these out. I've done it on each game so far. I can at least give my review of it, actually, now that I really think about it. If I was to give this a review, like, today, like, if this, if this was the game that was presented to me and it was just told, hey, this is the game, just came out last week. Huh? In 2024. Yeah, in 2024, in a modern scope, I think the game is fine. I would think the game is... I would probably judge it like a six and a half out of ten. It, it, it satisfied twelve to fifteen hours of my day, or of my time. Sorry, um, it was entertaining for what it was. Uh, I think the game concepts are a modification of Final Fantasy One and Two, which we recently played. So I like the idea of them evolving. It also kind of helps for me. That I watch a YouTube channel called Final Fantasy Union. Shout out to them. Just because I like them. Uh, they do a lot of very good Final Fantasy content. And they like doing short form like documentaries. And they did like the complete history of Final Fantasy 3 the other day actually. And I just watched it. And I gotta say. I didn't realize that 1, 2, and 3. I knew 1 saved the company. Two, I didn't realize that they made a sweeping declaration right after one that they basically weren't going to do sequels. We didn't get sequels until almost 20 years later. So they made that a very clear declaration at the beginning. So we knew two was going to be a completely different story. And one, two, and three went up in ratings and uh, critic scores each time one of them came out. So, like, the first one, I think, was, like, an 87. Uh, the second one ended up being, like, a 92. And I think 3 is, like, one of the highest-rated Final Fantasy games there is. I think 3, 4, and 9. 3, 4, 9, and 10 are the highest-rated games that they've come out with. So, it, it's very interesting to play it in perspective of that. Uh, if I played it back in the day, I would have thought this is probably really hard. And it would have been very difficult to figure out where to go and what to do. But it would have been a challenge, and I would have probably figured it out eventually. But, yeah. Ah! Uh -huh. Just because I'm a kid. Like, if I was a kid, I wouldn't be paying attention to half of what they fucking told me to do or not do. Oh, I can save it. Data saves progress up to the final boss. I'm just going to create another file. There we go. Just in case I want to go back, screw around. Actually. Before we call it a day and get the fuck out of here. Let's load. Yeah, let's. Where does it take us up to exactly? I just want to know that. Okay, uh, it's exactly where we were when we did the boss. That's kind of cool. Just sad we didn't get one job level to 99. I don't think it's worth the time to go back and do. Five million? God damn, dude. We, wow, Stefan, wow. Okay. All right, guys, calling it there. Have a wonderful night. Thank you again for stopping by. You're the best. We'll see you on the next one. Bye-bye.